Hello guys, welcome to Rams Play. Today we are gonna check some quick fact comparison between Mudrunner and Snowrunner along with some Q&A's. Welcome to the next gen off-road experience. The Snowrunner world is massive, spanning multiple maps and three different regions across America and Russia. There are over 30 square kilometers of hostile lands to chart. More than three times larger than the previous games in the franchise history. Each map is filled to the brim with a variety of contracts, activities, and hidden secrets to discover. You will have to pick the most adapted vehicles and gear up if you want to achieve your missions. The truck store has a huge number of vehicles available to you from nimble scout vehicles that can reach any destination, to heavy 10 wheelers that can carry any load. Choose wisely and build up your own fleet from the 40 various vehicles and brands available. With several engine options, gearbox settings, suspension heights, tire types and sizes, and more. You will find plenty of ways you can tune your vehicle for any situation. This includes adding a snorkel to challenge water rapids or, modifying a rear-wheel drive vehicle to go all-wheel drive for better off-road strength. This time we have a total of 40 vehicles announced where the Mud Runner only had 19, more to come in the season passes and our modding community has already started creating cool stuffs. Also we have some licensed vehicles joining our franchise, namely Chevrolet, Freightliner, Ford, Caterpillar and GMC with full interiors hyped me up. Vehicle customization are another core feature which the Mud Runner compromised with its simple add-ons. Expand and customize your fleet with many upgrades and accessories. Activities are not just car going logs between two points, now we will come across six new activities which includes rescue missions, delivers logs, crates barrels, tubes, co-op mission with your friends. Finding new trucks, parts, explorations, completing these will give you huge rewards and unlockables. Add-ons and trailers can be fitted to your vehicle to match any situation. A fuel tank can be brought for long distance journeys while a telescopic crane can net you a hefty bonus for packing the haul yourself. As you travel the world and complete contracts you will discover new regions, new landmarks and key places that will help you in your journey. Like watchtowers unveiling new portions of the map gas stations for the long haul, garages for upgrades and more. Bridges can be constructed, and roads can be cleared giving you even more ways to tackle your missions. Your decisions and actions will directly impact and modify the environment around you and the way you will explore the lands. Eventually, you will reach the endgame contracts. One new types of cargo to move around with dynamic weight and truck physics, that's a lot. So we won't get bored carrying just logs. So then I've been thinking of the damage physics in Snow Runner a lot, I wish it to be like a little less than BNG Drive. At least I hope the statically changing damage physics LL change since this is a new game engine. Then seasons and weather, I wish they have added some rain. Snow falling and overcast weather modules inside the environment it will be cool to turn on your wipers and drive through heavy rain in the muddy watery forest routes. Okay, now let's jump into a quick question and An answer session. Question, what is Snow Runner? Snow Runner, the sequel to Mutt Runner, is the ultimate off-road simulation experience featuring incredible snow and mud physics in beautiful and wild environments. Question, when is the release date? Snow Runner releases 28th of April 2020. Question. What platforms will the game be on? At launch, the game will be on PS4, Xbox One, and PC, via the Epic Games Store. Bad there is no Steam. Question, how much will it cost? The standard PC edition of costs $24.99 and premium edition which is the full game and season pass costs $36.99. Question, will SnowRunner support mods? Yes. SnowRunner will definitely have mods at launch on PC. We've worked a lot on the mod structure, and this will benefit to all platforms. We aim to support mods on consoles post-launch as well. Question, will the game be supported post-launch? Yes, we have big plans for post-launch content, and we'll announce more details about this closer to launch. Question, will SnowRunner have microtransactions? The answer is no. Question, will there be multiplayer? Yes, SnowRunner will support up to four players synchronous multiplayer. Question, does SnowRunner support cross-platform play? There are currently no plans for cross-platform play. 
question. Does Snow Runner use the same engine as Mud Runner? Sabre ported Mud Runner's terrain simulation into its proprietary Swarm engine, so it's a completely different engine, but using the same terrain simulation that makes Mud Runner Mud Runner. Question: Will Snow Runner have RTX support? It is currently too early to tell, but we are exploring the possibility of having features like this. Thank you.